hi guys welcome back to my channel so today we'll be making moi moi the most delicious moi moi ever first of all i'm starting by peeling my beans what i do is i put my beans in the blender and i and i act as if i want to blend then i turn it off like you turn on the blender you turn it off you turn it turn on the blender and you turn it off and you do it for like three minutes so you don't have to soak your beans before doing it because when if when the beans is um, too soft it will blend so i don't soak my beans i just pick the stones and i just pour it in the blender and i add water i'll do this for some minutes when i'm sure from the blender you can see the beans the beans is peeling so when i see that it's like it's properly peeled i'll turn it in the bowl then i'll wash it i'll wash it i'll take out the beans shaf and i'll wash it very well so this is what it looks like after blend after peeling and washing it takes me about 10 minutes to do this it's very fast so i'll be blending the beans with tatashi onions and ataro dough and shombo I blended off camera because I had to go do it outside. It was a bit, it was too much, so I couldn't blend with the blender. And I was in a hurry, so I had to go out to use the bigger blending um, engine to do it. So, yeah, I have my fish, my deboned mackerel fish, my maggi, my egg, my oil. Then I mixed my seasoning with um, my salt, mm. hot water. That was why I poured first. I'm going in with some crayfish. Just a little. You don't have to put too much. We are not making soup here. And I've noticed too much of crayfish make the moi moi black. So we don't want that. We want our moi looking all fresh and yellow in complexion. <laughs> so I'll stir the crayfish properly. Then I'll go in with my oil, my granite oil. I'll add a little and I'll stir, stir, stir. You can see the moi moi is actually much. I'm not making for myself alone. I'm making for the entire house. So I'll stir properly. Then it's time to wrap. I am using my moi moi leaves. I think this is plantain leaves too. That's what it's called. I'll be using it. And I'll make like a cornish. Is there anything like that? Like a cone size size or shape yes like a cone shape then just just watch how i wrap it <laughs> so after which i will go in with my moi moi my moi moi paste then egg and fish i really don't like scattering the egg inside the moi moi because most time you hear people saying auntie there's no fish in my moi moi so i just put egg and moi moi i do it like that and you don't have to put too much else it will spill I made some mistake while wrapping this, it's, but I, I learned, I made a mistake while wrapping it, but you don't have to put too much and you just take it to the back like this. So I'll do that for the remaining and...
Before we continue this video, have you subscribed to my channel yet? Please take a minute and go subscribe to my YouTube channel. It motivates me and always like and drop a comment. So this is the last moi moi leaf. The moi moi leaf wasn't enough, so I had to use the moi moi plate. There's a plate we use to make moi moi too, so I had to use it to complete it. So guys, I put the moi moi in the pot and I allow it to cook for like 40 minutes. But before I put the moi moi, I had to place some leaves at the bottom of my pot before placing the moi moi and this is the cooked moi moi called it tasted so good and everybody liked please it please guys try this recipe and let me know in the comment section i will see you guys in my next video bye <laughs>